you got to remember, this was 1977. There were no 24 hour newscasts. Mm -mm. There wasn't, you know, Fox, MSNBC, CNN, all of those people covering the news 24 seven. There was no Twitter. There was no cell phone. So you were just getting the news when it came over the radio or the TV. And so parents were rushing to the headquarters. And by 215 that afternoon, Greyhound buses would be entering the lot, unloading the girls that had just left from the day before. Now, what the girls didn't know, what had been discovered at 6 a.m. by a camp counselor on her way to the bathhouse. So as this counselor had walked along the trail to the bathhouse, she discovered a little girl lying on top of her sleeping bag near the base of the tree. So at first the, the counselor thought, what's going on here? You know, has this been an accident? What's going on? And she immediately ran back to the other counselor tent, yelling him to get up and do a head count. We need, she was unsure what was going on. So one of the counselors started the head count. The other counselor got to her car and jumped in it to go get the camp director and the nurse, the camp nurse to 